And this is the scene here at the Cardiff City Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It is Manchester City facing Salzburg. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. Delivering it. Well, clattered away. Well, let's see about the cross. Really good high press. Well, a chip that went awry. Well, maybe it was the right option, but his technique let him down there. City have the ball again. They need to get tighter here. Holland and a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there, but they do take it well, you have to say. Red to win possession back. Happy birthday to Alex O'Neill celebrating today from all of your friends and family. Nicely timed tackle. Moving into the advanced position. Well, disappointing end to the move. He's in behind. And still an opportunity. Sekou Koita. Well, there you can see, City haven't been able to control possession, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. I've got to say, he landed really heavily on his shoulder there and looks like he's in severe pain. But he looks less concerned than the bench, who are worried about him. I think he'll stay on. Cheers, Jeff. that he did well to win it back. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Getting forward, but really sticking to the task defensively. First half here comes to an end. 
Well, you might say par for the course as far as Erling Haaland was concerned in the first half. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Really good high press. Well, a chip that went awry. Well, maybe it was the right option, but his technique let him down there. And they need to get tighter here. Holland! And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Attacking possibilities on the flank for City here. An alert piece of defending. Holland. Sekou Koita. And City recovering possession well. And intercepted there. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Now can they counter clinically? And a throw in for Salzburg. And they know they need to stop him. Who can he pick out? This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. That'll be a Salzburg ball. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. Really a very poor ball. A creative look about this. This might be ideal for the counter. Wonderful challenge, and a throw-in coming up. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Oh, lovely weighted ball, they might be in. And the pass getting in the way. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Will just take another look at this because he reacts so well and he then keeps his composure. It's a good finish. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Well, as we get close to hearing the final whistle, Manchester City dominant, Manchester City excellent. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and the real chance. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Now, sending it in. Well, there's no way to escape the verdict that that was an awful corner. Good pressure high up the pitch. 
and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Grealish. Gives it a go. A oh, good hit, close shave. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. Bernardo. But he's got past his man. Dangerous ball. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. And over it comes. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages. They'll be happy with the three points, but now they have to back it up in the next game. Six points and you're halfway there. As a footballer, you can never be quite sure how it's all going to unfold, but suffice it to say, it unfolded positively for Gundogan. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.